How's it going guys? I wanted to take a few minutes to talk to you all about uh, the new Metasys MUI, the new you know, Metasys user interface is basically what MUI stands for. And I want to uh, encourage some of you guys out there running older systems that you might want to start migrating to the MUI uh, within Metasys and start getting things set up. Now it's basically uh, like setting up almost a new operating system for uh, Metasys. It is a completely different system compared to what you're used to using the SMP. However, with the way that technology is changing, uh, there's not really going to be much options left, you know, uh, just because of just technology in general. You know, uh, Johns Controls is moving heavily away from Java and anything associated with it. We're getting more browsers and things like that that are stop that are uh, going to stop supporting a lot of the software that's out there. You know, just like recently, Flash Player has. You know, it's been done away with. No browsers are supporting it. Also, Silverlight, as of the time that I am recording this video, is going to be ending here within just a few months. And I know that uh, some of you guys out there, I am sure, will be affected by these changes just as we have been. You know, Silverlight is uh, used in some of the graphics that we have. We know that we are, are no longer going to be able to use those. So we have been working to transition away from SMP from that uh, type of system and are starting to use MUI a little more. In fact, I know that I've had some of you guys ask me about uh, some of uh, doing some videos on MUI and I am going to be starting uh, that here very soon. Uh, I've already got a few ideas in the works how I'm going to start out and the reason that I haven't done any as of yet is for the simple fact that I've been trying to learn some of this stuff myself. I have been working with uh, a couple of techs, a couple of JCI techs and basically they were i just sat down with them and uh you know this one in particular he's been real great helping us and i uh, sat down with him literally spent some time with him he has walked me through on how to set up a lot of things in the MUI stuff set of graphics and just a whole lot and when you first start with the MUI, it is very complicated or so you think the more you get into it you start to see just how easy it is uh there's the more that i use it the more that i like it and I can see a lot of benefits to many of the features that are currently in MUI. Now, we are currently running at 10.1 as of the time that I'm making this video. I know that the upgrades to 11 are out there. Uh, as of version 12, the SMP is going to require a license. And, you know, they're trying to drive everything more towards the MUI. So that's another reason for you guys out there. You may want to start to migrate to a newer system. I know that I have had uh, people contact me running, you know, version Metasys 4 and 5 and just some of the way old stuff. And I'm really surprised that you guys are still out there at some of those levels. Uh, just because of the technology, I would highly encourage you to start upgrading. But guys, this is just a quick video that I wanted to do. Um, I know that uh, there is a lot of things going on technology-wise right now. Uh, even within Metasys, I, I, some of the things that I've heard, there's some back and forth between the, uh, what's going to happen with MUI as far as whether or not they're going to try to make some of the user views that are currently in the SMP migrate over. I've heard that that's a possibility. I do not know. Uh, but there are uh, certainly benefits to MUI that are currently not in the SMP that are very beneficial depending on what you are trying to do. Uh, I know for us, we're becoming very much uh, data and analytical heavy. You know, that seems to be where a lot of things are going these days. But anyways, guys, uh, check out the rest of the videos on the channel. Look forward to videos on MUI, on how to set it up and that sort of thing coming in the near future. And guys, if you have any questions, leave them down in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Check out the links down in the description, and we'll see you next time.